The Way of Love for the Lord Chapter 8 The Holy Eucharist that I received every day came to my soul as a sweet rain. Easter of 1981 Since I became a catechumen, I had been attending daily Mass. Even though I was not able to receive Holy Communion then, how fervently I had desired to meet the Lord through the holy sacrifice of the Mass. In the end, I was baptized a Catholic and received the Holy Eucharist. How urgently I had longed to receive the Eucharist until then. With what could I compare this joy? Even if a pilgrim wandering through a desert for three whole days found an oasis, could his joy exceed mine? Even if a farmer saw it raining after seven years of drought, could his happiness surpass mine? As I thought that the Lord, who is all of my love, would live in me from now on, I felt an immense happiness that can never be compared with anything else in the world. O oh, Jesus, who is living in the Holy Eucharist, now the Lord, my beloved, has been coming to me personally. The Lord who comes to me as a sweet rain through the Eucharist whispers to me in a very kind and silent voice. My beloved baby, whenever I see you fervently longing for me, I cannot help but be happy to the point of forgetting all the sins in the world. Oh, my Lord, I am a mere unworthy sinner, but I am also very happy. Yes, that's it. I am living in the very heart of you who think of yourself as unworthy. Lord, I am so grateful to you for loving me, an unworthy one. Never leave me, but always be with me. Of course, I will always live and stay in a little soul like you at every moment.